Hi friends, welcome back to Gyan Vigyan Foundation's Ayer Academy and you are watching my YouTube channel Gyan Vigyan Foundation. So friends, today in this video, we shall try to understand one another subtopic in physics that is about the thermal properties of matter. So friends, here in this particular topic, we shall try to understand one another subtopic that is about relation between principal and molar specific heat capacities. So friends, now let us try to understand this subtopic. It is a relation between principal and molar specific heat capacity which is given by the following expression. That is molar specific heat capacity is the product of molecular weight and principal specific heat capacity. So friends, now let us see the next point that is about the values of molar specific heat capacity of some commonly known gases which are given in terms of joules per mole per degree Kelvin at both the molar specific heat capacity of gas at constant pressure Cp and molar specific heat capacity of a gas at constant volume Cv. The gases like helium is having its Cp equal to 20.8 and its Cv is equal to 12.5. Similarly, we can see guys about the hydrogen gas that is H2. It has the value of Cp equal to 28.8 and Cv is equal to 20.4. Similarly, we can see nitrogen N2 which has the value of Cp equal to 29.1 and the value of Cv equal to 20.8. Now, let us see about the value of oxygen O2. It has the 29.4 Cp value and the Cv value is equal to 21.1. Now lastly we can see about the carbon dioxide gas that is CO2 has the Cp value equal to 37.0 and the Cv value is equal to 28.5. So friends by now you might have understood my subtopic in physics and if you have understood my subtopic in physics then please like comment and subscribe my channel.